What up, YouTube? What up, boxing fans? Apparently, Carl Frotch, uh, you know, sometime after the, the Amir Khan Danny Garcia fight, had an interview and suggested that, hey, you know, it, it might be time for Amir Khan to retire. It might be time for him to hang up the gloves. That's, um, that's very strong words coming from, uh, basically the next, probably, probably now the more popular fighter, or the most popular fighter coming out of the UK, uh, and the more accomplished fighter coming out of the UK that's still active right now, and Carl Frotch, who is, who is, uh, who just is off a huge win, uh, against Lucien Butte. But should Amir Khan really retire? You know, he's still a pretty young fighter. Although, um, what I would suggest is what a lot of people are suggesting. Change your trainer. I think Freddie Roach is a problem. I think Freddie Roach uh, is losing his abilities to improve fighters. I, I, I haven't seen any bit of improvement in Amir Khan since, the, since Marco Antonio Barrera. Since he fought Barrera, what has changed? I don't see any changes. And, uh, you know, it was evident that uh, his defense really needed a lot of help uh, against Lamont Peterson. And Freddie Roach has done nothing to improve him in that area. Same for Manny Pacquiao. So, I think Freddie Roach is a common problem among many fighters uh, who lack defense. And, um... And my personal opinion is he should change, change trainers. Maybe he should go to Mayweather Sr. He's someone that uh, doesn't have a great fighter, and uh, and he has the capabilities of training, uh, you know, fighters at the elite level. Um, maybe Jeff Mayweather. Maybe uh, maybe a guy like Robert Garcia. Maybe a guy like uh, Kevin Cunningham. You know. Someone who fits that boxer puncher uh, uh, training style. Maybe even Emmanuel Stewart. Hey, you never know. Um, that would be my suggestion for Khan. I think he he really needs to to understand what his fighting style is and how to execute it uh, in a matter that will get him victories and will, you know, he basically has to minimize his punishment while maximizing his offense. And you do that with defense, you know, a la Floyd Mayweather. You do it with defense. So that's just my take on things. Carl Frosch thinks he should retire. I think that's going a little bit overboard. Um, you know, he still knocked out Zab Judah. Like, Zab Judah, uh, you know, still among the elite. Although, he's definitely taken uh, a pretty big hit in his, uh, in his prestige as an elite fighter. So, um, that's what's up. Comment, rate, subscribe. Take care, guys.